taking over for the main event here in the heavyweights. First up, we got this man, Neil Pickup from Blackburn in England. He's a multiple British, European and world champion. And he's also the captain of the British team out here in beautiful Gothenburg for the Fitness Festival. And he's going to have his hand full today. Look at the man coming up. A young lad from Sweden who stepped in at the last minute. His name is Fearless Philip Berenkreutz. As I say, last minute step in. Neil's uh, opponent had to pull out. And a couple of days ago, Philip was pulling a competition. Stepped up and says, you know what, Neil? I'll have a crack at you. And this is what we're going to get. Hi guys, I'm Neil Pickup, I'm from England and I'm here in Gothenburg at Arm Wars Valhalla to pull young Philip Berenkreutz. This guy is a powerful puller, but he's a youngster. And this is my game. Arm Wars is my format, this is what I do best. And there's another twist in the tail. My intended opponent got injured at the last minute. He had to pull out of this thing and Berenkreutz has stepped in. For that I give him massive respect, but I'm also going to break my shoe off in his ass. You don't come in at last minute and take anything from me. And he certainly won't be doing that here this weekend. I'm sorry, I'm going to apologise up front. This is his home country and I hold nothing against him. But I am going to beat Philip Berenkreutz here in Gothenburg. Confident words from Neil Pick up there. Come on, let's bring this win this Sweden by Hallow. It's a roll of form at the moment. He's been tearing it up in the uh, Arm Wars Super Series. And here's our Swedish debutant, Philip Phyllis Berenkreutz. As Neil said, he stepped in at the last minute. Let's You're see what he's got. He's knuckle completely. I need you to come down off of that for me. Wrist there. Wrist, wrist, wrist. wrist. Referee's just making wrist. sure there's some fair more. play in the setup. A little bit wrist. more on that wrist. Don't move it from I want to get the wrist straight. Ready, go. I want to get the guy set. Oh, oh, oh. oh now. <laughs> if you're going to go through Neil, up. that's the way you've got to do it. Philip has just gone route one with the top roll. Wrist, 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 wrist. Naturally, now we've slipped. We have to go to the straps, and there's no running away now. Come back for me a little bit. This should favour Neil because he can get him onto his arm. Philip can bust that hand back, which he's not going to do this time round. Uh, looking, yeah. looking in control, Neil. Oh, Philip moves into the dead wrist press. It's, uh, it's not the best of moves. It's going to burn his arm out pretty quick. But Neil's going to be quite happy sitting at the base, uh, as you can see. That pin. Oh. From here we can see Neil sitting strong at the base at the back of the pad. He's got the hand control. I think Phillips is he's a wise man here. He's a, he knows when he's a beaten man, so he's going to give that pin away, regroup, and come back. Try and get away through that wrist. He's got a powerful arm, but it's all about going out on your shield in Valhalla. I don't want to go out on my shield. I want to see that son of going out on his. Oh. 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 Mm. Got a man in uh, Philip Berenkoit's oh, corner. Johan Brunden, another one of the Swedish debutants. Centers this way a little bit. In Gothenburg. Wrist both of you. A little bit on that wrist, this shoulder for me. Ready to go! Oh, another massive hit off the start for Philip. Phil's, uh, Philip's really, really woken up on this one. Neil's going to have to work hard to uh, to control that and contain that hit. Ready, go! Oh, a little bump there, looks like he just missed it. And Neil is taking the strap to his advantage here. Loading back with the pressure. And I think he's just teasing Philip a little bit here. That's not to take anything away from the young Swede. His arm is very, very strong as you've just seen there. Oh, he's making it hard work for Neil. And yeah! the pin. Yeah! Oh, you can see how much that meant to the Englishman. Oh. This, uh, this young lad from Sweden certainly living up to his name of Felix. The arm strength is there. I think the experience from Neil is just shining through a little bit. You know something that's bad? If you're ever pulling or doing any sport with a headache, I don't know why, but I've had a killer headache for like the last hour. I'm waiting for this match to come up. I try to take a painkiller, make that thing go away. Oh no, oh no, it haunt me still. But that's okay. Hope you're enjoying this at home, because the fatty's coming to get <sighs> oh, a little bit of uh, <laughs> a little bit of information for you there. And uh, Neil is, is competing this match after having uh, 
two or three days on the trot, long, long, hard days. Practicing, Ready warming go. up, arm wrestling. And this is coming to the end of the weekend here in, in, uh, in Gothenburg. And the fatigue is starting to show. There's still a lot in the arm though for Neil. But this is better from Philip, much better. He's tucked into a strong defensive hook, looking confident, moving into the press. And Neil's looking for that reversal there, looking to open the hand up of Philip Berenkreutz. Run back. Ooh, a little running foul there for Philip. A little running foul. Drives inside with the press. We slip and we have to go to a strap. Now, just to let you know about the running foul, if the elbow comes off the pad during the match, Ready go. But it goes straight back on. The referee will signal a running foul. If he comes off the pad again, it's going to be a loss. All we get is a restart. And yeah, they're looking a lot breathe, stronger in that position with a strap. Breathing's much, illegal. Much if you want to win, breathing's illegal. You breathe, I move, you're doomed. As he says there, it's all about the game of breathing. You breathe in, tighten up. As you breathe out, your opponent times it, runs through your hand, takes it to the pad. That's exactly what happened there. Timed it on the breath perfectly. Get water tight, put your fingers in your ears. No breaths, because smart men move on breaths. Watch Frodo Hoagland videos. Watch Nicholas Nanastad videos. Watch Jeff Hale videos. Philip's going to have to uh, do a little bit of thinking here. Everywhere he's gone, Neil's had a counter for it. So we're heading into round four. And uh, Philip's setup is a little different this time. It looks like he's going to try and drive into the press or possibly inside into a hook. Yep. Oh, hard hit. Driven straight on that press. Neil kind of feel it coming. Sets up with a bit of back pressure. Try and peel out of his hand. Take it, Philip, you want it. This is where Neil wants to be in the strap. Ah, no. oh, yeah. That strap allowing him to apply a lot of back pressure with his arm. Doesn't really have to use the hand so much. <sighs> Philip has to work hard here. Now, what can he do? He's going to have to come back. Oh, he's trying to counter with his own top roll. Woo, nice. Ooh, oh. Strength in his arm, strength in that base. <clears throat> Neil's working diligently to maintain that position. Trying to work on the oh. arm of the young Swede. It's just not going down. Oh, there we go. There we Plan. go. Plan. Plan. Oh. This is only a baby, but he's going to get stronger. Every little move you see from Neil there. Look at that little, little re-grip. Re-grip. Moves off his hand, moves further and further out onto his fingers. We're into the realms of physics here. This guy's so a beast in a hook. Point. Might as well try him out there. Don't know whether I can pull it off of you, gotta try sometimes. Once you know you can do what you can do, try something you don't know whether you can do. And I really don't know whether I can beat this kid and hug. So let's find out. And Neil wants to take it inside, but as I was saying previously, right. it's simple physics. The further away from the pivot point you move the, you move the load, the more force your opponent has to apply to control you. Wrist a little bit, both guys. Wrist. Ready to go. Ah, we're gonna go into the hook here. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, now, maybe I can. I think five rounds yeah, ago, yeah. this would have been. You've got to try different things. Though. It's like going out for food and you know I like that. <laughs> if you have the same thing every week and I write in stones, you have the same thing every week, then you'll never know what you like. And Neil just calling on his uh, wingman in the corner there, Ian Stones. Neil and Ian have been buddies for, for 20 odd years now. Ian's the smallest man on the team this weekend. And he is the owner of the most magnificent moustache. How are you doing, Ali Pickup? You're still the world's most beautiful. And I still can't get home. And when I do, you better run. Because <laughs> I'm coming to get you. I'm coming to get you. <laughs> this match is really taking its toll on the, uh, the young Swede here. A little bit of information about Philip Berenkowitz. This is a man with a 300 kilogram deadlift, so strength is certainly not uh, not foreign to him. He's 
definitely a well-rounded arm wrestler. He's not just trying every every different technique. He's he's applying them with different angles, different leverages. But it does seem like he's got a lot of work to do on that wrist of his. If he can tighten that wrist up, get that stronger. He's going to be a hard man to beat. Showing his versatility there. He's originally outside the match. Starts losing his hand, brings his shoulder across the table and drives in on the tricep. Does cause the slip. So again, we go back to the strap, which is where Neil feels very, very strong. Keep that fingers closed. Keep your fingers there closed. There you go. Um, now pull it to the back. Pull it to your back. There you go. Work, 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 work. Slow and sure. No jerks. Here. No breath. Squeezes. Squeezes. Watch. You ready? Squeeze. There we go. Look at that. That's yeah. textbook reversing top roll. There you go, big boy. Gotta say, hats off to the young sweep for stepping in two days after of pulling an absolute war in a little competition that we were running to find some new talent for the series. But it stepped up with an amazing five round match, watched by myself and Neil. And we both nodded to each other and said, yeah, this is a guy that can do well. I can't even imagine this boy fresh.